harbinger of uninhibited hilarity in Edgar Hygins. All those patients. Mr. Derek Parkin! <laughs> strange and funny. Grandfather died and left me his property and money. And when the will it was read out, they told me straight and flat, if I would have his money, I must always wear this hat. And now everywhere I go, people shout out, where did you get that hat? Where did you get that tie? Who oh, isn't it the lovely one? It's just a proper style. I should like to have one just the same as that. Well, I go, they shout and know where did you get that hat? It's true, you know. Everywhere I go, people laugh at me and my hat. Yes, they do. I don't know why. It's a beautiful hat, that. A beautiful piece of material. You feel that, Mr. Sachs. Feel it. It's felt. <laughs> Grandfather Sir Big Nelson. Upon the briny sea, and braced upon the quarter deck, though a none so brave as he. When Nelson got his fatal wound, and on the deck did swoon, instead of kissing Hardy, he began to croon this tune. Who did you get that head? Where did you get that tie? Who is it? like to have one he has the same as that. Well, I give the shout and then where did you get that hat? Rocky from Florida. <laughs> Grandfather was a dustman when he left the great navy. Despite his dirty trousers, ladies took him in for tea. They offered him their crumpet. <laughs> and homemade cakes as well. For they were eager that he should to them the secret tell. Well, where did you get that hat? Where did you get that tie? Who is it in the lobby one? Just upon the spot. I should like to have a bunch of just the same as that. Well, now I get the shout of me. Where did you get that hat? Don, don, don. When Grandad did his courting, and beneath the moon he sat, to whisper his sweet nothings, he would always wear this hat. With Brinton down to hide his blush, he'd offer her the ring. In awe and admiration, the young lady then would sing. Oh, where did you get that hat? Where did you get that tie? Oh, isn't it a lovely one? It's just a the style. I should like to have one just the same as that. Where are I go? They shout, oh, where did you get that hat? Now, following in father's footsteps, I got married just last week. And naturally, I wore this hat, tradition so to keep. But halfway through the service, when I came to say I do, the vicar said, but first there is one thing I'll ask of you. Who are you to get the hat? Where did you get the hat? Who is it if you know me when you get the top of style? I should like to have one just the same as that. Wherever I go, they shall get the way to get the hat.